Shiba Inu, no bad idea AI, bad, on Shibarium, SHIB team issues warning. The SHIB community has been issued a crucial warning by the Shiba Inu team. Lucy, a Shiba Inu team member, shares an important announcement about the bad idea AI, bad, token sent out by DaVinci, a Shiba Inu Telegram administration. In his message, DaVinci says that while the bad idea token is an official partner of Shibarium, it has not yet been bridged on the platform. He further stated that any replicas claiming otherwise are deceitful and will be banned from Shiba Inu social platforms. Dollabad is RC20. This is because the Shiba Inu team prioritizes the security of the community and, hence, will not support scammers. Shiba Inu and Shibarium users are urged to rely on official sources for accurate information. Lucy also reiterates that Bad Idea AI, Bad, is an EC20 token and is not yet on Shibarium. Shib Army Scam Alerts, or Susbarium, echoes a similar warning, this time issued by Mr. Lightspeed, a member of the Bad team. Mr. Lightspeed calls attention to the fact that certain individuals are attempting to capitalize on Bad's reputation, by launching tokens on Shibarium under its name. He warns the Shiba Inu community that any tokens launched on Shibarium with its name are not associated with Bad Idea AI, nor have its endorsement. As usual, users are asked to do their research, DYOR, as these tokens are likely to be scams. In exciting news, the bad team says it has scheduled meetings to begin planning its bridging efforts to Shibarium. It promises to inform the Shiba Inu community of any information that arises when it is ready to proceed. Other warnings emerge in a new tweet, Shib Army Scam Alerts, or Susbarium, dedicated to protecting the Shiba Inu community and uncovering scams, issued a key warning as fake accounts proliferate. In this regard, Shiba Inu holders are warned to beware of impersonators and scammers who often create accounts to trick users into following them with the intent of providing misleading information to create doubt, misdirect to fake websites, or even obtain personal details that can be utilized maliciously. Instead, they should ensure they are connected via social media to only official people and also verify sources before taking any action.